Duraclean. Duraclean is a vastly improved antimicrobial disinfectant. It lasts longer, it can be safely applied to a variety of surfaces, and it is highly effective against algae, bacteria and viruses. We've put the product to the test, so take a look. Hi, I'm here to demonstrate with an ATP meter the bacteria on surfaces. So I'm going to use a saline solution swab and once I take a sample of currently what's on here and high touch areas like doorknobs, armchairs and surfaces, I'm then going to check, we'll check for bacteria. Once that's happening, then I'm going to move to Duraclean long term. It's a disinfectant and see how that works on the areas. So let's swab the area first and see what we can pick up. Make sure to turn and twist and rotate this to pick up all the particles, including on the chair surfaces, on here. And these are high touch areas, so it's good to test them. Put that in, break the saline. You get a little click. Once that happens, shake it up well so it coats the whole area. You need a good swab, a good result. This takes about 15 seconds. So what we're after here, while it's counting down, is we're after anything under a 10 is um, very safe, it's very good. Anything above a 30 is a fail, which means it's a concern. So we're about three to four seconds off reaching what we will achieve, and the results should come up at 1,399. So that's certainly above a 30. So now I'm going to apply the Duraclean to the area. All the areas I've touched already. Then I'm just going to dry light, very lightly to dry it off. While this is drying, I'm going to change swabs make sure it's nice and dry, and then we're going to test it. And we'll see how well it worked against the, uh, the 1,399 particles. That's certainly above a 30. Okay, this takes a few seconds to dry. I'll just give it a hand to dry. And then I'm, I'll get another swab, a clean one, and I'll test it again. Just another piece of paper to make sure we're very fair about this and dry it off. Okay. So as you can see, that's nice and dry now. All there is again. Okay, now with this new clean swab, we'll do the same areas again, back and forwards, and rotating the swab as we go. Same areas again, and of course the same air high touch areas again, again. Pop the swab in, break the saline, give it a shake, and we'll pop that in. And now it'll count down. Once that's done, once the reading's done, I'll, um, I'll be disappearing for about two hours. This, this room will be in use, and let's see what how effective Duraclean long term is. So we're five seconds off, you're coming up with a result. It's come up at 19. So we're well and truly below, below 30. So it's not a fail, which is great. So I'm going to take my toys with me and my Duraclean and I'll see you in about two hours. Thank you very much. I'm back again. So two hours have passed and uh, we're going to test the area here, test the area there and we'll test here again which I tested before. So a nice clean swab. And we'll test all around here. And here, the exact same area as I tested before.
break the swab, give it a good shake. And again, as you're aware from last time, we are after a below 30. So we've run the time lapse, some people in and out of here, I'm not too sure who, I deliberately kept myself away from here, so we can be as transparent as possible with the results. So five, four, three, we're just nearly there. And our results are 16, we are well and truly under 30. So that's a successful test of how good DuraClean is. Enjoy DuraClean, thank you very much. DuraClean.